The all-new Hue 2 lighting system from NZXT brings even more possibilities to your setup, with addressable RGB underglow, cable combs, and monitor lighting with a unique ambient mode that pulls colors from your primary display to create a one-of-a-kind gaming experience. Check out everything Hue 2 has to offer in the link below. My name is The Ryer. You'll know me by now. I'm a famous. You'll know recently the Intel commissioned Principal Technology to run the testing on their 9900K, most powerful CPU in the world. Then, Principal Technology commissioned me to be the head of their benchmarking team. How could I say no to such a great opportunity? I never benchmarked before. So today, I show you the genius interworking of our testing methodology. Prepare to be impressed. This is one example of our AMD testbed with a 2700X from the Ryzen and the EVGA GTX 1080 Ti. Now to make the testing process faster, we have a many AMD testbed and a many Intel testbed. So many testbed, we run out of wall socket. So we plug all the AMD testbed into an Amazon basic power strip. We would have used Surge Protector, but this one had prime shipping. Now you can see we use the AMD stock Kura, same Kura that come with the CPU. But the 9900K, no ship with Kura, so we just use a modest aftermarket solution. You can tell we take our testing very seriously here at the PT Rev. We do not play games, okay? We test them. So now I show you how we benchmark with the GTA 5, okay? First you look at the setting. So many settings here. You should know at least what two or three of them mean, or else you make a bad test, okay? So I know the resolution, aspect ratio, what are these things? What are these things do? Ah, it's like an NSYNC, but the Chinese knockoff boy band must be the game music. So I turn it on. I rather the music like an NSYNC. So sexy. Now we do a free test, okay? Not a free, not a free test. Free, free test in a row for maximum accuracy, okay? We, we don't do a free test. Intel pay us a shit ton, okay? Okay, so we do a free test. Test number one, here we go. Things are going smoothly so far. We have a benchmark still running, system purring like a tiger, but we have a dust buildup on the CPU Kura. No good, so I take a can of compressed air, just a little spray. Just a, a little spray. Ah, who the fuck? Use all my compressed air. What's that you, Jose? Fuck you, Jose. Pick up your shit and read your fire! This is so bad, because the dust buildup could affect the performance of our testing. Fortunately, we have a backup fan. So we turn it on. Just a little bit. Ring around the rosy. Ah! There's no working. Oh, we need to turn it higher. Must go higher. Good as new. My god, the benchmarking so boring sometimes, you know? You just stare at the screen, look at the number, go up and down. <laughs> That's why I always run the battlefield in the background when I'm testing. That way I can just pray for a few minutes and then go back, resume testing afterward. Such a good idea. Die, motherfucker! <laughs> go back to your home run! Now as you can see, we're on the second benchmark run now. Things are going good, but the GPU coil wind for this card so bad, hurt my ear. So for the third benchmark run, we use a different GPU. I have a different 1080 Ti right here. Same card, 1080 Ti, 1080 Ti. Oh, that's a 1080. That's a, it's okay. You know what the Ti stand for? Tiny different. It don't matter, it's fine. No problem, no problem. Now we have the GTX 1080 installed, and we are on our third and final benchmark run. So exciting, we almost done. By the way, I turned the V-Sync off for this run because <laughs> I could not hear the music. It's a stupid setting, you know? Rockery should have no impact on our data. Here we see our three benchmark run score. Run number one, 60 FPS. Run number two, 61. Run number three, 81. Now here at the PT Rev, we take the median as the final score. Middle number, 61 frame per second, okay? Now, so many people say the average much better than the median. But who wants to be average? And how can the average be better than the median? You cannot be better and average at the same time. 
so we take 61, final score for the 2700X, that's a score I stand behind confidently. So now you know how we roll at the principal technology. Very fancy, you know. Thank you to Intel for this job and my new car. Thank you to you for watching this video. If you like me, you want to make love to me, toss a like on this video right now. If you don't, I put a moldy wonton in your shoe. And when you put your shoe on, you smell like a Chinese shit. Peace and happiness to all of you. Bye bye.